lot of stress. A lot of stress all over, but we have it handled. As you can see, our party is full. Everyone is here. Guys, um, the last Smash Direct just came out for me. I'm coming to this pretty much right after watching that, and I still have not recovered. We might have to talk about that at some point today. But what we should really talk about right now is this new episode of Darkest Dungeon. Hey, guys. I already decided where we're going to go today. We are not going to the courtyard. Stop trying to make me go to the courtyard. We've been to the war Warrens, we've been to the Runes, we've been to the Weld. Um, you need to keep doing quests in all these places because you're trying to forge a path to one of the bosses. But we have not even been to the Cove yet, which is one of the major locations. We've already prepared a team. I'm bringing Ray back in as a shield breaker, um, who is... Interesting thing, you have uh, the ability Scientific, which is you take less healing from the abilities Divine Grace and Divine Comfort, uh, Vestal abilities. So, rather than bringing another Vestal along, I'm going to have my healer be Seraph, you're back in. Um, you're a little bit sick right now, but there's some good things about your Grave Rot and your Rabies, so... Um, I think it'll be okay, and also you kind of have moves that are good against Eldritch, which hang out in the Cove a lot, and you're an Eldritch hater, which is even more damage. And you got a fear of mankind, so I don't really want you going anywhere else too much. Uh, also, though, we got two newcomers, or, you know, you've seen them before, but this will be their first mission. Asmer, who, um, I'm just very excited to start leveling up a Grave Robber. And, uh, Jester, who is a Cove Adventurer, uh, Modern Mouse. Uh, this co-adventurer will be joining us. A uh, quick thing I want to address, though, while I'm here, Adrian Carr, who is the first abomination that we got, even though that's the person who made the request, they had asked for a different name, and I missed it. I did not notice. So Adrian Carr is being renamed Zane. I hope that's okay with everybody. Um, maybe Adrian Carr was his original name before he was bitten, but now he is a lichen and was branded and was given the new name Zane because a human name like Adrian was not fit for such a vile abomination. We need to get some trinkets out to everybody, so let's unequip them from everybody else and let's equip our trinkets here. Alright, and that'll be it for now. Um, Blight Charm on... Uh, yeah, some Blight Resist on Seraph, some Blight res some Debuff Resist on Ray, and some extra damage, uh, and some Scouting and Trap Disarming abilities for Asmer. Uh, sorry, Modder, but it'll be alright. Uh, keep in mind, if you guys don't remember that not all characters of the same class, it, it doesn't mean that they have the same skills and the same abilities. There's... Each one of these classes has... Um... Sorry, each one of these classes has... Uh, seven different skills that they might have. I bought way too much stuff there. I don't know why, because I was thinking about what I was saying, rather than exactly how much I was buying. I always buy more than I need, you guys know that. The Fishfolk Scaled Skin affords them increased resistance to bleeding attacks, which is why we brought, brought some people like Asmer who can deal blight. We're not really trying These to bleed the enemy out. These caverns are teeming with pelagic nightmares. They must be flushed out. Alright, I've also been told that I was using uh, the People Antiquarian wrong. The flow of other Okay, here we go. Uh, we got our... Uh, this is a skirmish, so we're supposed to complete 100% of all room battles on this quest. Ray, you did have a little bit of uh, stress to begin with. Uh, most of you did, actually. Why? Where did all the stress come from? Well, anyway. Um, we got... This is our Pelagic Shaman. Um, he's the typical stress dealer here. This guy, I believe can deal bleed and can also move us around, but this is the one I want to take out first, the Drowned Thrall, because he explodes, and I hate that. So, what what does this do again? Moves you forward and lets you block two things, which is pretty cool. Uh, but maybe we should go for straight damage, which is what we're going to do, because I want to take you out before you can explode. Exploding is very annoying. Um, you don't have an attack on the front line right now. I could... And you're too close up to the front to do the lunge. So instead... Yes, there's the Blight. Two damage per turn with the Blight. 
Uh, you have a knee attack here, which also does not hit the front line, so my plan's kind of not working already. But, um, the bread and butter of the Jester's attacking set is Harvest, which is going to hit both the second and the third ranks and have a bleeding chance. Um, these guys have pretty good resistance to bleeding, unfortunately, so... Um, we're looking at, like, a 50-50 chance of this bleeding actually going off here. Yeah, that's alright. We still spread some damage around. Yeah, I guess that's the only thing I about this team I picked that doesn't quite work. Um, and that I can't seem to hit anybody on the front lines as much as I wanted to. But we are going to... Do you have any protection on you? No, but this will still make you deal less damage, which is nice. Uh... No, I'm going to go for the pool. Right? No, I'm going to go for the damage, actually. Alright, so the Blight is going to kill you before you can cause any more stress. You're attacking me rather than exploding, but I think you're going to give me enough time to kill you, you big lug. So, let's start bleeding. I brought extra bandages in case somebody gets inflicted with bleed. Because that can happen when you're healing with with bloodletting. There we go. There's my kill. And I'm going to go for some stress heal, actually, because I can't hit you in the front row. But this is what's great about the Jester. I'm, I just lowered you eight stress. Thanks, Mouse. And there's a buff there, which means that you're going to take decreased stress. Oh yeah, that's that's fine. Just attack twice in a row. That that's great. Nah, it's all right. It's all right. You can still hit with blade in the front row, huh? Um, I think that's. Yeah, I think that's how that's gonna work. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. And no quarter was given. All right. So that's a uh, 450 gold right there. If you add it all up, good. See, I brought another extra another, shovels. Another misfortune. Yeah, so this is the cove. This is where um, people delivered a lot of stuff by ship to the manor. And, um, you know, because he was all rich, the ancestor owned it. Uh, but because he had such decadent taste and was looking into dark magic, a lot of dangerous stuff got delivered to him to the point where he kind of needed to make a lot of deals with pirates. Oh, no, it's a madman. These guys are annoying, too. These guys are stress-dealing enemies, but, like... Way worse. They are the worst of the stress dealing enemies. Look at this. Look at this guy. Oh, three stress per round. This is new to me. I actually haven't seen. Uh, this must have come from one of the updates. It's an, it's like a poison, but it poisons your your peace of mind instead. Ugh. All right. Well. Don't know how much damage we're going to get to the back row here. Oh, that's perfect. Thank you for moving back, dude. That's actually exactly what I needed. All right. Looking at who I can hit. Yeah, I'm going to... I'll take that 75% chance. No, it wasn't good enough. I really want the madman out of here. I hate him. But these guys are dealing a lot of damage to me, so maybe I should be more worried about them. I'm going to... Ray, I'm going to take one more turn of not healing you. Just hold hold firm there, Ray. Alright, Madman is bleeding. And Doomsay, he is going to stress everybody out a little bit. You see how these guys are a problem? They're a problem. Uh That doesn't do damage, it just stealths you. So do I wanna go for the kill? Yeah, let's go for a kill. Take a kill if you can get it. The reason why we're not healing yet is because we want to get some enemies off the board to try and take control of the battlefield just, like, a little bit. Oh, that's a 40% chance to hit. That's that's no good. That's not going to work for me. Um, what would this be? A 35%? Yeah, no wonder that's not hitting him. We're just going to cast heal. Okay. Seaward Slash. And that's going to do all the damage right back to us. That kind of sucks. Stupid dodging madman. Oh, no, that's that's door already, isn't it? Crap. Terrible vistas of emptiness reveal themselves. 
Well, at least you're not bleeding, I guess. Alright, we gotta go for some good damage here. And... Ah, just hope that you don't get attacked, man. Continually onslaught. Wow. That got bad really freaking fast. Okay, give me the attack first. No, alright. Yeah, accusing the Jester, that's fine. Jester's getting accused. Um... 75% chance to hit, 90% chance to hit. Um, do I want to do something about the damage or about the stress? This doing two more damage one more time. Okay. Two damage, two damage. You're out of here. Don't die, don't die. No! Man, what the crap? That was just some bad freaking luck all over the place. Ray, I dang that that blows. Okay, we got we got to take our revenge here. Unfortunately, we can't because we don't have any. Oh no. I have a problem here. I'm not going to be able to hit the front line with anybody. Um, I can hit the front line with you, though, if I do a finale. Alright, Modern, show them how it's done. Boom! Which moves you to the back of the class. Alright, I can pick your trinkets back up. Freaking what? Am I going to try and muddle along with just three characters? I spent all this money on stuff, too. Crap. Um. No, it's pointless. We can't, we can't go this early without... Ignorance of your enemy? With only and three people. Will invariably lead to defeat. Yeah, well, wasn't my fault, man. Okay, we got a Nocturnal in there. We got Tone Deaf. That's a bad thing for a Jester to be. You take minus 20% stress heal from your own inspiring tune. That's awful. That must be a Jester specific one. Ray. Ray. Oh god. The discoverer sadly has perished from innumerable insect steams. Concerned rises. Tivies in town are slightly less effective. This is the same thing that... Was I just, like, not gone long enough to... On a hot streak... Okay, um... Ice Scroll is on a hot streak and won't leave the gambling hall. Uh, but the stress healing is working. Um, Darius got less stress... Bullheart got less stress, but became enlightened, which means in town you will only meditate for stress relief. And Prankster has returned from the vision quest. Welcome back, Prankster. Ray, I'm sorry, that was just pure RNG happening to you right there. That... Huh, man, and you were at level one also, and you, you know, you were a cool shield master, dude. I guess you got some big shoes to fill now, Neuro. Or is it Neuro, like, Neurological? Well, means that we can, uh, hire somebody else. And there's another Shield Breaker right there. So, we only have room for one more person. Let me, uh, consult my list and decide who I want it to be. Yes, Bounty Hunter it is, and the name of Bounty Hunter is going to go to Pyro... Cumulus, thank you for joining us. Um, I hope you survive longer than some of the other people. You're Hippocratic, so you get plus 20 on healing skills, but you don't have any healing skills? You have a healing camping skill, I guess. And you have uh, extra max HP, because you're tough. You also don't resist blight or bleed particularly well. And you have some of the different things, like finish him. You still have the axe move, you still have the uppercut, but you also have the flashbang. 
uh, none of the hook chain kind of stuff. So Pyro, you're more of an axe based person right now. So once again, everyone is here, except for Ray and Eliza Ludus. Uh, met their end against the Pelagic Grouper. Uh, do I want to do anything about- No, because I have none of the gold now. I have none of the- Wait, 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 wait. But didn't I collect gold- Well, I'm supposed to keep the gold that I have when I take that job, right? Or did I do something- did I do something that costs money and, like, already forgot about it? <sighs> okay, well... If I go back there... Because I'm determined... I don't want to do another medium place. I will do another short one. And there's some slippery boots. So, guys, we're, we're going back to the weld. We need more deeds anyway. So, let's see... Uh, let's see who wants to go to the weld. Seraph, you were, you were doing fine. This wasn't your fault, but I, I, I need you to chill back here real quick. We're going to take a gorilla group into the weld, hoping for the best. Let's pick Darius. You come back in. Oh, wait. Darius is level one, but yeah, more healers are good. Darius is coming back in. Uh, George, you're going to fill in the back here. Uh, maybe I won't put you in the back, maybe I'll put you somewhere else. Hold on to that thought. Um, and we're going to have Zane. We'll keep working on your stats there. And Shadowblade. We don't have a lot of money, so we need to get more money. Alright, so you guys are actually getting two quests for the price of one here. Let's, uh, oh man, this is so bad. Okay. Food, 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 food. Shovel. Torch. And that's it. The rest of it, we just need to hope for the freaking best. Oh my god. It's recommended you take at least eight food on this quest. Well, I can't afford any more food than that, so yeah, we're going in. We're going in with barely anything. Each of you gets a Nutrigain bar and the clothes on your back. Going in with one torch here, too. Okay, so the mission here isn't so much going to be to succeed. I knew all these paths once. Now they are as twisted as my own ambitions. Okay, yeah. We're not going to try and beat the level... Like, if we can succeed in the quest, that would be great. But really, we're just trying to find stuff and get out before we lose too much stuff. That's... That's about all we're doing. Pick up as much stuff as we can before we freaking die. So, we want curios. Um, that's... No, that's not what I meant to do. Alright, more torches. Thank you. We're actually going to let the torch get a little bit low. Uh, yeah, we're going to be acting in a um, decent amount of darkness today. But it also means if we let it get into low enough darkness, we'll uh, not take as much or we'll, we'll find more treasure. That's how that's supposed to work. Alright, got some damage there. Some damage. And this is going to hit both of you. Can it do damage? Yeah. Okay. One slime gone. Uh, sorry, Green Scorpion. I could have brought you instead, but I also want to try and work on people's experience. But we're probably not going to pass this, so that's not going to matter too much. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing, guys. I really don't. I, I've been RNG'd into a corner. And... This is just... This is a bad time. It's gonna get easier when you... After you get past a certain point in the game, when you start getting into higher levels, you start making money more and you have more powerful guys. I feel like there's a period at the beginning where you're losing guys much more rapidly. And... Yeah, that's kind of what I'm dealing with here. Alright, trying to stress out the wolf boy, huh? 
Well, I won't let you. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. All right. Why did I not gain... It was as if I didn't actually gain the gold from... From from that last mission because I got like a thousand some right when did I spend more gold I mean I knew I wouldn't have much but I didn't ha think I'd have nothing you spiders I hate spiders you killed Ludus take some grape shots and take some bile continue the onslaught destroy them all and um, kill you first. Oh, why did I kill you first? You were bladed. You couldn't have hurt me. You had no way to hurt me. Yeah, that was, that was a poor move. Sorry, George. You're, you're taking that stress because of a poor, a poor decision that I made. Um, what's this? Heal two points for two rounds. Yeah, sounds like a good idea. So that if you get your turn... No, you're not going to get your turn. I'm just going to kill you right here. Oh, but it stays up after battle. Cool, so you'll heal more later. Um, I am going to light those now because you are so stressed right now. I want to try and keep you away from the affliction. There, there's some of that healing. Very nice, very nice. Uh, got some busts. Loot are often low on supplies. And... Well, I don't have any more torches, so I don't need to worry about that. I only brought a shovel because I didn't want to, like, start the quest and immediately be like, Oh, I can't go any further because I'm not using my bare hands again. It's a bad idea. Oh, okay. Shadow Blade's just gonna go through there. Why do you just check stuff again? Because you're curious. That's right. Yeah, Ludus was curious, too. Look what happened to her. We are going to be in pitch black darkness soon. Um, okay, and you guys are hungry. Crap, crap, crap. Crap on a freaking cracker. Uh, no battles, though. There's a suspicious lack of battles, and there's an obstacle coming up ahead. I do have a shovel, so I feel good about that. Oh, there's an obstacle on this side, too, so... Secrets and wonders can be found in the most tenebrous corners of this place. Tenebrous. I do like the word tenebrous. Alright guys, we're exploring the tenebrous corners. Nature herself, a victim to the spreading corruption. Malformed with misintent. Uh, the music's getting all crazy because we're all alone. Where are all the battles? This is freaking me out, man. Oh no, okay. Take 20% damage plus stress damage. To fall for such a little thing. George is getting hangry. George is getting hangry. Ah, oh, he's irrational. He gets irrational when he's angry. Uh, fetch me a newborn lamb. Oh dear, dear, dear. Okay, what does um being irrational do besides make you do some dumb moves? It's going to lower your damage. Well, I guess I don't care about that. It actually increased your crit and your speed. So, I don't know. Maybe this will work out for us. Maybe it'll be okay. Maybe it'll be okay. Maybe this will be the 90%. No, actually, if we can get to this last room here, I think we'll pass the quest and have 3,000 gold. Though this is a particularly long passage, and we gotta fight people now. We gotta fight people in the dark. This is actually looking like the toughest battle we've had this entire time. Um, yeah, let's get some blights off. There we go. Blights moving around. And... Can we heal up the whole group? There's a crit on that. That should lower somebody's stress. And it does, Shadow Blade. Shadow Blade, this is the perfect place for you. You're in the shadows. You're the blade of the shadows. Soon I'll have you start blading people. Oh man, the flatulent when he takes damage, he's like, yeah, hit me. Um, how much damage can we do to you? Can we do enough to kill? Maybe. Not enough to hit. Alright, so we are... We're below 40%, so now we can use this. Which is melee damage, and it ensanguinates, and it makes him start healing himself. So, alright Darius, let's see what you can do here. Gonna punch with a spiky fist, and you heal yourself a bunch, and you got a debuff. What debuff did you get? 
okay, you got worse at healing skills. I guess that's to keep you from really, like, spamming it. Okay, you're almost dead, Mr. Slicey Dicey, but first you're gonna slice and you're gonna dice. Oh, you're low on health. Um... I want to do a... Huh. Do I want to transform? I think it would be a good idea to transform. We're gonna transform. Alright, Zane! The beast is loose! So, we can do a rake, which is gonna kill... We don't have to really r worry about killing you, though. That's the thing. Um, but it would damage this guy, too. Or we could do a rage, which... Would do more damage. Um, 83% chance to hit. Or to this guy, which might even kill him. So let's go for the kill. Yes! Yeah, there's the kill, Zane. Good job. Alright. We gotta do this. We gotta do this for Ray. This is all in the name of Ray. That heal is in the name of Ray, and also for Darius. He's getting really hurt. You Did you just lose stress? Well, it looks like that came just in time. Oh, wow. George, eat a Snickers or something. You're not you when you're angry. When you're hungry. You know what I mean. Um, Shadow Blade. Be the Blade of the Shadow. Alright, you did it. That's gonna take care of him. He is completely taken care of now. So, what else do we have? Um, reclaim. Which is the self-heal move. Yeah, we don't have a way of hitting you in the in the back row there. Uh, but we do have a way of healing ourselves a little bit, which we will do. Oh, no we don't. We can't we can't do that on ourselves. We'll put some restoration on George. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. Alright. So nothing to worry about now except this one gunman. I'm hoping he's the last battle in this corridor and we can go home. Also, there might be a battle in this room, though, so we are far from resting. Good damage, good damage, good damage, and the bleed. Thank you. All right. Let's finish it off with whichever is more accurate. That's base 90. Uh, yeah, hit it. All right. Victories mount, so too will resistance. It's a nice little bundle of cash. Look at how much more stress we take, though. This is four times the normal amount of stress. I don't think it's literally multiplying it by four, but it is a lot of stress. All right. Uh, no battle here, please. We don't need a battle. We don't need a battle here. We don't need it. Oh, there's a battle here, and it's against freaking mushrooms. Okay. All right. This is it, guys. This is. This, this this is our last um our last trial. If we can make this work without deaths, this will have been a really good run in the welds. Uh, I'm I just started thinking to myself, what am I what am I going to do for um for the thumbnail for this because we're on two different missions in this episode. All right, there's the buff. Let's take the rake. Very good. Two damage to you. All right. Um, who do we want to heal? Everybody. We want to heal everyone. I don't want to heal Darius too much because I want him to be able to do his really good moves like this. All right. So that's going to do three to five damage and bleed. That would take care of him. That would take care of him pretty good. Let's do it. Alright, so you're bleeding for seven now, and Sanguinate, I guess, is just really good bleed. Or maybe that's just the two bleeds on top of each other. You know, kind of like how in Pokemon there's poison and then there's toxic. That's the crit. No! Darius, don't die! Darius, don't die! No, I can't lose another one today! No, 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 no! Okay, okay, hold on. <laughs> Excuse me. You're supposed to have, um... As a flagellant, you're supposed to have pretty good, uh... Death's Door resistance, right? Right? I think that's a thing. I think that's a thing that flagellants have. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Um. That'll do 3 to 5, 3 to 5, or is there any chance of killing him faster? No, there isn't. So let's spread out our damage some more. 
We're going for the quick damage here today. And you are going for the healing yourself. Wait. Um, self heals 34% max. So yeah, you should do that again. You should do that again and kill this guy. Good. Good, good. Good. Take that heal. Take that heal, Darius. And... Wait. You're no longer afflicted. You don't take... You don't have mortality debuffs after... After you're healed off death's door. That's very interesting. That's a very interesting thing to know about you, Darius, and I guess all other flagellants. He's like, yeah, you know, I whip myself in penance all the time. I'm used to being on death's door. That's like Tuesday for me. But it's not Tuesday today. It's Thursday or whatever day you happen to be watching this. So I don't know. Oh, I forgot that Moosey forward. That's fine, though. You can be forward. Okay, this will hit with an 85% chance. This will hit with a 90% chance. Do I want the 90 or do I want the 85? I'll take the 85. Oh, it didn't kill, though. I only took the 85 because I wanted it to kill you. Man. Anoint yourself with the holy blood and be damned! Alright, George. Take it down a notch. We'll, we'll get Wendy's on the way home. We're almost done here. We're almost done here. Uh, let's do... Do we want another is Insanguinate? I mean, it'll heal you, so... Yeah, what's the downside of doing that? Freaking nothing. I want heals. Oh, it healed zero. That's unfortunate. We can't even do anything about your, uh, Blight there. Which is... Muy unfortunate. Alright, Zane. Tear it up, Zane. Let's get another heal here. Yeah, if I turned you back to human form, you actually wouldn't be able to do anything from the front row, so... And Shadow Blade with a kill! This expedition at least oh. is a success. Alright, we're gonna get out of here, but first we're gonna open up this chest with Zane. I don't have any keys, so just open it. Thank you. Oh, this is a trinket. I could've... Oh, it's the same thing you already have. Now I have two Virtuous Chalices. I might sell one. <sighs> Alright. Do we want to risk it and go in any further? Oh, the room's right there. The room is right there. Guys. We've done really well. I'm really proud of us. I say let's go one more room. Okay, how much is this going to stress you out, though? Um, or at least let's, let's open this up. Pack has already been looted. Uh. Okay, should I do it? I'm gonna roll a D, I'm gonna roll a D6, okay? One through three, I go home. Four through six, I do it. One, we're going home. The dice never let me down. I think we could have survived, but, you know, Ray's teaching us to be cautious. Alright, there's some actual decent money. We're still not rich, we still don't have the money to do all the things we want to do. But, we did get some stuff, so... You know, it, it, it put us back, our, our heads back above water now. And you're gothic! Zane, that's a good thing for a werewolf to be. Um, word recon reconstruction? Is that one of your skills? Yeah, I think that's the one where you heal yourself through, like, meditation. A fresh irritant to some. A I sanguine memory to me. I feel like I need to go do this place so that I can clear it out so that I can clear out all the bugs so that this event will stop coming up. Maybe. Uh, Ice Crawl, your gambling seems to have gone well. You lost a lot more stress. The town is still a buzz. And, oh yeah, I didn't even pay attention. Shadowblade, you're now at level 2. So Shadowblade and Lady Robin, who are my original two characters, are now uh, my strongest two characters. And George is level 1. Always good to have some leveled up Vestals. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but the deeds that I got should be enough for me to be able to increase the size of my barracks to 21. 
And you know what that means? That means hiring more people. So, we got two Crusaders in here and one Antiquarian. We definitely want another Antiquarian to take Ludus' place. And since we don't have anybody else signed up for Antiquarian, Ludus wasn't even signed up for Antiquarian, actually. We just, um... We just kind of gave it to you, gave it to them. So, who do I want from this group here? I want Vroni. Oh wait, that's my hotkeys. I need to be naming them. Your name shall be Vroni after the sub. Vroni17. Thank you very much, Vroni. Let's see what you have. You still don't have the basic knife move, the nervous stab. Uh, you have the festering vapors that cause blight. You have the little heal. You have the guard me. But instead of the dodge, you have get down, which moves you back and buffs yourself. Uh, I'm not loving your skill set here, actually, Vroni, but I might take you into battle soon. Because I want more money. Uh, as for these Crusaders, um, I am going to bring in straight from my good friend Missing No the Great. Uh, this person's name is going to be, I hope it fits, Ramona Summerwish. Oh, it doesn't quite fit. Um, I'll make it fit. I'll make it one word. Ramona Summerwish, because that's a really cool name, so I want to try and make a fit. Alright, and Ramona, you have the Smite, you have the Zealous Accusation, you have the Battle Heal, and you have the Holy Lance Lunge Forward. I wish you had the Stunning Blow, but that's okay. You have a lot of other cool stuff, and you are now a member of the team. Let me carry you on to the team here. A mighty sword arm anchored by holy purpose. A zealous warrior. As for the last Crusader, we don't need... Nobody else has signed up specifically for Crusader now. And I don't really want a third one. So I'm going to leave this one go so that I have two more rooms in the roster for other people next week. So until then, I'm the Comic Foil and I need to do something about my party here. See if I can treat some of their stresses. Ray, thank you so much for serving. I'm sorry it was so short. Everybody else, thank you for fighting alongside me, and thank you for watching. I'll catch you later.